Hey guys, welcome back to Clever TV. I'm Deidre Behar, hanging out right here in Zoe Hart's office with, of course, the man, the myth, the legend, Wilson oh, Bethel. Yeah. <laughs> Look, you live dangerously. You, you're eating some Greek yogurt and a blueberry muffin. Yeah, well, that's about as dangerous as I live these days. Um, it's really a pretty tame existence. You Is know? it? Yeah, the, the days of battling lions and excessive yeah. drug use, that's all in my past. Right, good. Yeah. Well, we're glad that you left that for shirtless scenes yeah. in abundance on Heart of Dixie. Um, I'm going to get the really tough questions out of the way. Oh, wow. You stuck a knife in our hearts a couple of weeks ago when you decided to have a little transgression with Miss Zoe Hart. Where were you at when you found out, when you read the script, were you just uber disappointed in, in Wade's behavior? I spent a week in seclusion, crying salty tears. Uh, oh, when I finally- really hit you. Yeah, it, it, struck, it, it struck my heart in, in, some, in some pretty meaningful ways. Uh, no, you know, it was, it was, uh, it was it's pretty heartbreaking because at this point, you know, I, I, Wilson Bethel, have a very, I feel like I have a relationship with Wade. Of course. And, um, and I I'm care about I care about him, yeah. And so obviously, when when he screws up, it's like seeing a close friend, you know, screw up. Um, so I, yeah, it was it was it was sad, but I also ultimately have hope because, as we all know, people screw up. So uh, I've I've got hope that. You know, Wade will be able to, to to fix things for himself. Whether or not that means he ultimately ends up with Zoe, you know, who knows? But uh, okay, well, you're kind of leading me into my next question. What I do best is yeah, of course, Segways. segways. See? Bam! Yeah, All about it. Put it there. Is there going to be a chance of redemption? Do you think Wade is going to pick up the pieces and and kind of in the woods? So blunt. Yeah, okay, saying. so yeah. so he's going to do. Clever, is this on the internet? It is on the internet. Well, so we can say. Well, we're going to beep it out because okay, we're well. a PG-friendly audience. But you know what? <laughs> this is a man who does not care about, about uh, yeah. So he is going to patch things up, you think, with, with Zoe and try to make it well, work. Um, you know, I, who knows? He's definitely going to try and make it work. Um, but, uh, you know, ultimately that's partly on her. So uh, the way that the season ends um, is... Who knows? Okay. Is you know they they definitely leave the door open. It's it's a little the ball's a little bit in her court. Great. Um. So. Uh. But yeah, as far as like redemption goes, you know, I think there's a way for somebody to be redeemed without necessarily ending up with you know the girl. You can you can choose to live. Know. It's sad. It's, it's sad. sad. Potentially. I'm not saying that that's how it's gonna be, okay, but you know. So we're gonna hold as out. a possibility. Okay. Now I have to get your thoughts on Zorge, the. Oh, refuse you refuse to acknowledge it. it. Okay, so that's that's not something that's, you think is going to be in the pipeline. I don't know what Zorge is. Next okay, question. We, we'll, next we won't talk about question. Zorge on this show. <laughs> uh, no, come back, come back. we got to talk about your diet, your oh, muffins. Oh, 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 right. The ladies can't seem to get enough of the shirtless scenes. Oh, when is the calendar coming? Um, questions of, of that sort. Kind of indulge me a little. Uh, Are you cool with it when you see the script and you're like, oh, Wilson shirtless? Are you just like, bam, let's go do it? Well, you know, at this point, I, I, I definitely feel like a bit of uh, a, a hooker. But uh, <laughs> but you know what? Magic Mike made that okay. He did. Yeah. Channing Tatum paved yeah. the way. Yeah, he really did. He's. I've always said Channing Tatum's a pioneer. He He's is. He's kind of like Rosa Parks, yes. you know? And, uh, and I, the feel, same. I, feel, I feel like I'm part of that movement. You are. The, I'm really The Channing Tatum movement. Great. So we'll look out for you in the Magic Mike sequel. Yeah. Oh, wow. Uh, there's a thought. Of course. No, you know, I mean, it's it is what it is. Um, and you're happy to do it. But like I told you, uh, my you know, in we've got a few months off here. My my big plan is to gain about forty to fifty pounds. Okay. Um, most of it goes to my a and, and a okay. And so Which are looking great today. Thank you. I appreciate that. I was gonna undo an extra button for you, but you know what I thought. Your cleavage is minimal, but you're leaving more to my imagination. That's where you're wrong. See, my cleavage is actually spectacular. <laughs> You're covered up. I've got you could I've got button. bees on a bad day. Oh. Yeah. All right. Yeah. So well, I'm glad just you showed so you off know. on the show. Just the so ladies. you know. Yeah. Uh, now I have to ask you a question. I was I was just playing around on my what, phone. What is, what is I was playing oh, around on my God, phone no. and I found oh, this a fan site. A oh, a Zade wow. fan site tweeted this. Can we zoom in on this oh, a little bit? Man. Please now, for mercy. everybody who... I will, never, I will never be able to explain to you that haircut. Uh, okay. that you don't need to explain the haircut. You need to explain what's going on here and why you love Rachel Bilson and how you've loved working together for so many years. Man. How old were you there? Do you remember? I was, do you remember? I was probably 18 or 19. Okay. 
Okay. I, was, I was probably 19. Shooting a scene at OC Harbor High School. Yeah, Harbor High School. Yeah, that was my first job in Los Angeles was working on the OC, um, which I got fired from. Why? Uh, oh, it's a long story, but... It had nothing to do with Rachel Bilson. No, 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 no. No, I, I, was, I was just a bit of a screw-up at that point in my life. Mm-hmm. Um, Way to turn things around. Yeah, right. Talk about Hello. redemption. Here we right. come, baby. Full circle. Uh, You've known Rachel for a while, though. Well, yeah. I mean, I didn't really, I didn't really know her at that time. I was like, you know, I was the guy who, you know, you show up on set for a few days and then you're gone, and then two days later, nobody remembers who you were, or where you came from, and doesn't oh, care. That's not true. That's not true. You uh, were my favorite extra. Oh, shut any, up. Did you have any lines? Oh yeah, I had lines. Okay, come on now. Okay, okay. Such zingers as you're dating this emo geek. Uh, and, Talking about Seth Cohen. Yeah, and uh, and uh, like, what are you doing later, Summer? I think those are probably like so, some of my lines. I was. So you've been hitting on Rachel Bilson for years. That's what I do. That's what you do. Yeah, best. that's really. That's what I've been tapped. That's they've they've the powers that be have seen in me a capacity for that. Okay. And you know what? So be it. They're gonna pay me for it. Why not? Mazel. I was just gonna say though, my, my segue, bringing yeah. you back to segues. You guys obviously have wonderful chemistry, and yeah. and you seem like you're friends in real life. Yeah. Talk to me a little bit about working with her. Delight. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. She's a cool girl. Um, and are those are those sexy scenes a little awkward? Um, you know, it's it's. It's just kind of part of the, the, the part of the job, I guess. So um, any pre-kissing sex scene chats you have, or you just kind of go full throttle, um, embrace your creativity. You know, w- usually I'll I'll just I'll spend a little time, you know, moisturizing. Um, I'll do that. I'll, With I'll, Zoe's expensive products. Yo, sure, yeah, okay. yeah, coconut oil. Right. Um, Imported so, from Paris. Absolutely, mm-hmm. uh, I'll do some lavender scrubs. Great. Uh, I I just I want I want I want her to experience the bouquet that is Wilson Bethel. Amen. You know. Amen to that. Last yeah. question, I'll let you go. Um, aspirations for your character on the show. I know he's really stepped up to the plate. He's got the bar now, which is very mature, a very adult move for him. Sure. Is there something you'd like to see your character do? Is there a direction you would like to see him go in? And don't say drugs. <laughs> Water skiing. I just, I think that's, I think that's like the big final frontier for Wade is that he starts water skiing. So a big epic Gulf of Mexico water skiing shot. Okay. That's that's all I really want for this show. Uh, no, I don't know. I you know, I think I, I want Wade to. I want Wade to be happy. I want him to grow up a little bit. Uh, I want, you know, I want, I want the best for him. So whatever, whatever that means, as far as like his love life or you know whatever, I, I just, I think Wade deserves good things because I think he's a good guy. So absolutely, um, I agree. And not a fl- not without flaws, but uh, you know. But who isn't? Said well. Thank you. So uh, let's high five to Zade, and we don't know what Zorge is.